faith comes from hearing and hearing the word of God. Totoo yun. Okay? Sometimes when you are alone in the toilet, you just sing. In the beginning, you, know, you can hear it. And it will sing. And it says here, presence, the, the Greek meaning here is increasing or growing. Yun ang meaning na parang, in the Bible, ano, yung mga pangalan ng tao, may mga meaning yun. Eh. Si Crescentio. <laughs> It's also in the, it's interesting, no? may, may comment on that. He was believed to be one of the commission. Diba yung 72 uh, uh, disciples who was commissioned by Christ to go to the world because the harvest is plentiful, but the laborers are few. He was one of them. Sabi nung writing, no? You can read that in chapter uh, 10 of the book of Luke. And... He went to Galatia. Very young, si, si, ano, si Crescent, he was useful sa ministry because he sent him to Galatia. And also with Titus to Dalmatia. Titus was also a asset to the church. No? To Titus, a true son in our common faith. We have a common faith. Why? Because we only have one Lord, one Savior, one God. Common yun natin. Okay, so moving on, we'll be in verse 10, 11. Now, only Luke is with me. Luke is the writer of the Gospel of Luke. And what is the other book that Luke wrote? Huh? The book of Acts. Okay? <laughs> Hebrew was pinakawayan niya ni na it's Paul now. But the book of Acts was written by Luke. He was, di ba? Si Luke ang doctor lang sa God Apostles. And get Mark and bring him with me because he is helpful to me in my ministry. Now, this Mark is very interesting because there was an instance in the book of Acts na nag-away sila ni Bar Barnabas. Natural pala yung mag-away. Di ba? Ang important ay you said the Kung sa Bisaya na you said, Paul. Tignan siya, parang mga Beatles, mga Beatles. Anyway. Okay. Because it's a phone. You know, in the book of Acts, sabi dito, sometime later, Paul and Bar Barnabas, Paul said to Barnabas, let's go back to the, uh, and visit the believers in all the towns where we preach the word of the Lord and see how they are doing. Importante yun, ano? Sometimes I ask you, kumusta ka na sis? Kung may lang pa store, nangyari sa'yo, parang yan. Ini-encourage ko pa lagi. I always see to it na, yung nagtatanong ako sa'yo, I'm, I'm checking how is your spiritual life. Di ba? Kaya yung mga tao na, kumusta sis? Or... <laughs> <laughs> Praise God. That's all. Okay? Sabi niya, how they are doing. Barnabas wanted to take John, also Paul, Mark. Okay? With them. But Paul did not think it was wise to take him. Why? Because he has deserted them in Pamphylia. Wow. But I believe that sama sila ni Mark and Paul nag share. Tapos one, siguro one of the, siguro nakagod. I'm not sure it's not written. Ano? These are just conjectures. Ano, na hindi di nagiging lazy, nagiging you know, natakot, or ganun. He left them or deserted them in Pamphylia and had not continued with them in the work. Barnabas, ang sabi niya, they had they had a sharp disagreement. Ano? Sa Tagalog pa, nakasabi sa'yo pa, naglalis pa. Ano ba naglalis na doon? Nagtalo. Ano ang Tagalog sa... Nagtalo. Nagtatalo. Nag-away sila. Okay? That they parted company. See? Kaya na dyan. Kami dito. Kami ni Paul. Barnabas to Mark and sailed for Cyprus. But Paul chose Silas and left 
commanded by the believers to the grace of God. The narrative, Mark and Barnabas are related. Okay, very clear here in Colossians. My fellow prisoners, Aristarchus sends you greetings as does Mark, the cousin of Barnabas. Sabi ni Paul, kaya na. Si Mark yung relative mo ah. Ay, ayun sa'yo mo kaya. Kapamilya mo yan. Diba? And here, instead, nag-away, nag-away siya, diba? And here, sabi ni Paul, get Mark. He is useful for me in this ministry. It seems to me that they have settled their differences. You know why? Biblical kasi yung kailangan wala kang ka, ka friction ba? No, because I, 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 I've shared this before na mga tao na mga tao na asya nung Diyos nun ba? Masyado makadyos. Makadyos? No? Tao na yan, nandidesire kasi Diyos nun kayo. Masyado makadyos. Tapos, 10 years na hindi nag-usap sa kapapit, what kind of Christianity is that? Sino ba ang Diyos mo? Kasi pakalitan ko yung Diyos mo. Di ba? Maraming ganun eh. I don't know about you ha, hindi ko alam yung mga ano, buhay ninyo. Maybe you have somebody na, kumusta na yung relationship mo sa parents mo? Hindi mo na, kinumusta yung nanay mo. And yet you are in the church serving, you know, praising God. Di ba, naalala mo yung study natin, yung 19 characters? Di ba, nasabi doon na they have the, the meron akong simula dito eh. They have the I need to show that one. They have the image of Christianity but denying the power of God. Di ba nakita mo yung nasinare ko about Kanye West? He confessed that he is a Christian and yet ganito ang sinasabi niya. Nalilito yung mundo eh. And Paul, he understands na unprofitable to pag meron akong friction. And that is what the reason why some of our prayers are unanswered. Because it's very clear here in Matthew, therefore if you have an offer, offering your gift at an altar, and there is, you remember that your brother and sister has something against you, sabi ni Lord, leave your gift there in front of the altar. First, go and be reconciled to them. Diba? The priest ka dito, Here I lift my hands in worship. Yung mga music ko, nakasak na ko sa ilo. Patil ka mga ba? Diba? Tapos, you never talked to your sister for 20 years, for 10 years. Sayang yung tayo na yan. Sabi ni Lord, Anak, bayak-iyak ka ba? Sayang. You know, we can learn from this from Paul. Paul was really scripture-based. Alam niya na kung ganito ang ayaw ko heal yung relationship ko kay Mark. It would be worse. You know, so many times we have, we have this kind of attitude ba? Ang hirap kasi, pag hard kasi pinag-usapan, hindi mo makita eh. Ang motive ng tao. Huwag ninyong hintayin na nasa, nasa higaan na, no? O nakita kayo sa daan na yung, kala, yung ikaw mismo or kalaban mo. Change passage siya na. Sa oras yung 10 years na it's been wasted. Eaten by the locust yung ano mo, yung life. So, Paul really settled his differences with Mark. Settle your differences when? Now. Now. Tapikin mo yung katabi mo. Settle now. Marcel, settle it. He's growing up. No, maraming Christian. Those who are watching online, baka kayo yun. Kumusta rin mo yan? 
You know, yung mga away natin na natural yun, ni away yun na magkakapatid. Eh. Natural yun, magkaibigan at away. Natural yun. But you know, it only takes minsan text lang, eh? mga kumusta. Mag-melt yun eh, yung galit. Mag-melt yun. Ganun lang, ganun lang. Minsan nga, lalapit ka lang sa tao na pasensya na. O iyak, iyak lang yun. Ganun lang kasimple, ano? But because of our KFC. <laughs> diba? Ayun. Siya, siya naguna. Tinulungan ko siya. Kinain pa yung buong katawan ko. Kristiano. Sabi niya, sabi niya. Tapi ko ganun sa katabi mo sabi. Okay lang yun. Maganda yung word ni Lord. No? Talagang, this is what I like pag in-apply mo sa buhay mo. It's easy to say, but sometimes pag ikaw na mismo yung deal, but you cannot do it with your own life. But of course, you need God. So, settle your differences now. Now, very interesting si Paul, ano? Nag-away sila, but he has to settle. Why? Ang prayers ko hindi man sa'yo. If I continue with this. Now. So, in verse 12, sabi ni Paul, I sent the Kaitos, ay, mirap na mga panalan nito. Taikikos to Ephesus. Now, Taikikos, who is he? Sabi dito sa Ephesians, Taikikos, the dear brother and faithful servant in the Lord, will tell you everything so that you may also know how I am and what I am doing. Now, si Taikikos, para siyang messenger siya taga-deliver ng message ni Paul. Ano? And in Colossians chapter 4, Taikikos will tell you the news. Para siya runner eh. Very faithful siya sa Panginoon. You know, maybe a lot of people so they don't notice what you're doing inside the church. But God sees that. Amen. Hindi ba namin ma-acknowledge kayo? Ano? But God will. Salamat Taikikos. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's a faithful minister and fellow servant in the Lord. Talagang gamit siya sa ministry ni Lord. And then it says here, when you come, ito na yung sinabi ni Paul kay Timothy, when you come, bring the clue that I left with Carpus at Troas. Troas is uh, a, a seaport city, para siyang Hong Kong. Malapit sa dagat yung ano. Very progressive.